Well, now to Earth Week on GMA this morning. We're getting to the bottom of reusable bags and the impact they have on the environment. Rena Roy is here with more. Rena, good morning to you. Hey, Eva, good morning to you. Well, we all have piles of these bags lying around the house, right? Well, I know I do. And while experts say they are certainly better for the planet than plastic, the question now, is this too much of a good thing? These are just the ones in my car. Show me yours so I don't feel so alone. From the trunk of your car to that one closet you've been meaning to clean out. I have a lot of canvas bags. You're bound to find a few of those reusable bags lying around. If it's not reused, then it's not really fulfilling its purpose. And one of the worst things for impact on the environment is this throwaway culture, where you just take something, use it, throw it into a landfill. Big box retailers, trendy shops, and local eateries making it hard to keep up, churning out branded reusable bags and packaging too. They've become the greener alternative to single-use plastic bags, a symbol for sustainable living. But many of them are made of cotton, which has its own impact. We can reduce the environmental impact in one way, but it causes a different environmental impact. You use a lot of water to grow cotton, and often in some of these bags you have printing that is uh, toxic. Unfortunately, many of them are not really easily recyclable. A 2018 study from the Ministry of Environment and Food in Denmark made headlines finding that an organic cotton tote bag needs to be used 20,000 times to offset the impact from its production. But Dr. Cohen says he still considers cotton the better option. This certainly got a fair amount of attention, but it sort of misses the point. Cotton is a natural organic substance. You really have to look at the entire life cycle of the good, not just how it's made, but what happens to it at the end of its life. In the end, there is no perfect answer. Everything humans do has an environmental impact. The solution today, tomorrow might be a problem, you know, so we have to keep working on this. And experts say to donate or drop those extra bags off at a textile depository. There are even programs that turn them into something new. And Dr. Cohen says to decide when it's actually necessary to take home a new reusable bag. Guys. It's good to remember those bags mm -hmm. at, at the store, though, because they charge you five cents for the plastic or the paper. Yep. <laughs> Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.